going on you guys welcome back to the channel so as you guys heard the truck is up and running um, it actually turned on on the first try uh, from all the research I did I guess some people it just depends I guess right but to some people they can't get the truck to turn on it doesn't stay idling you know uh, for my case it actually stayed on and as you guys heard it's kind of rough because obviously it still needs a tune but for the most part it stayed running by itself which is pretty cool um, it still needs a tune as I said but the reason I haven't tuned it is I still want to upgrade some parts here on the engine before we get it tuned because there's no point of me tuning it now and then you know having to tune it later again uh, I might as well just do everything I want to do to it and then you know tune it later so uh, that's the plan for the truck but as you guys heard the clip it sounds pretty good I will also be including uh, another clip I, I have of the truck a little walk around you know that way you guys get a different um, angle of the sound and all that uh, she is running open headers right now long tube headers don't have an exhaust yet so that's why you know I'm kind of just waiting on getting it tuned as well because I don't know what I want to do with the exhaust yet and other little things I want to upgrade the intake manifold as I said you know just little things like that so um, other than that as you guys know at first I was low and slow now I'm thinking about switching it up a little bit um, I'll be showing you here what I mean in a little bit but uh, for those of you guys that are new to the channel I did take apart my 5.3 recently on my 05 Sierra uh, kind of gave it a makeover, upgraded a few parts, and uh, installed the Sloppy Stage 2 cam with the 2800 stall. You know, another little things, you know, but um, let me show you guys how the engine looks like. Alright, so I'm just going to go over what I did to the motor. Pretty much, it's going to be for all the new people that, you know, recently subscribed to the channel, or if you just come across this video. But uh, first, the main thing, we got a Sloppy Stage 2 cam on there with the high pressure oil pump. Along with the Sloppy Stage 2 cam, we also upgraded the valve springs to uh, PAC 1218. Um, we got some uh, eBay special long tube headers there. Pretty good. I mean, you know how they say, you get what you pay for. But honestly, these weren't too bad. I got a video on that. So I got a video on everything here that I did to it. So if you guys are kind of curious on, you know, the link to any of this stuff, I do have um, the links to everything just gotta look for it on uh, here on my channel but um long tube headers uh right now we just got them you know chilling there they're kind of just running open headers right now we got a cold air intake here kind of had to cut it right here usually it would sit all the way right here but since i got the cooler reservoir there got the wheel tub i did have to cut that pipe a little shorter just to make it work it was either that or um, downgrading to a smaller filter, which I didn't want to do. So, um, yeah, other than that, we got a 2800 stall. We also got Corvette servos. Um, what else? I think that's pretty much it, you know? Not too much going on with it. Just wanted to make it sound nice. I also gave it a makeover because if you guys saw before I took this motor apart, it was filthy. It was just covered in grease. I mean, I don't think the motor was ever, you know, worked on or anything like that. So it was just filthy. All right, so this is another angle of the engine. So I pretty much just upgraded everything that needed to be done to run that sloppy stage two cam. And, you know, like I said, just gave the motor a makeover, which it does look a lot better than what it was. But um, we are still going to be upgrading the intake manifold and the throttle body. I picked up a NMBS intake manifold, which is pretty much the same thing as a TBSS. So I'll be showing you guys how to hook all that up and make it work. But other than that, we also upgraded the transmission cooler. That way, you know, it runs a lot cooler, obviously. Um, this kind of like a true cool, but it's like a... Amazon brand, which pretty much the same thing. The only thing you're paying for is the brand, I guess. This was a lot cheaper. So I do have a separate video on how I installed this. I ran, um, I got rid of the stock lines and I ran my own lines, which is pretty much like a 3 8 line all the way to the transmission, all the way to the front. So I do have a separate video on that. Just look for it here on my channel, you'll find it. Let me go ahead and insert the clips I have of the truck idling with the cam and the little walk around of it.
you guys heard the truck it sounds pretty good and it's still not tuned right so uh as i told you guys we are going to be switching it up a little bit now i'm thinking about just having fun with the truck um before it was low and slow on 24s now i raised up the rear and i'm thinking about just having fun with it so i went ahead and picked up these race star wheels um just switch it up a little bit don't know if it's gonna be a long-term thing you guys know me i get bored of stuff real quick so we might end up going lower again on 26 24 who knows but these are some 17 inch race star wheels 265 60 17s i still got to get the front wheels but um when i do get the front wheels i'll show you guys how it sits my plan is to tuck these wheels in a little bit more that way you know it has a nice stance to it but um yeah like i said guys kind of tired of the whole low and slow thing so now i'm thinking more performance wise and who knows we might go back to low and slow well maybe just low performance wise still gonna be there but um yeah so that's pretty much it guys just wanted to show you what i got going on i know i've been lagging on the videos lately but just work keeps me busy but uh i'll be trying to upload every time i can so that being said hopefully you guys enjoy the video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe Catch you guys in the next one.